All right, go ahead. All right, by a show of hands. Speak loud, out. By a show of hands, who could break down Daniel, the second chapter, from the 31st verse on down? That goes into the uh, statue of Nebuchadnezzar and the, all the particulars from that point until now. Who could break it down? 2 and 31. 2 and 31 down, yeah. Minute to look at it, or you ready? You're supposed to just say, Yeah, I know the breakdown. All right, this brother, I already right. know. How am I gonna look at it? That's the attitude you're supposed to have. That's fine. So go ahead, who got it? Who got yeah, it? This brother right there. Speak loud. Speak loud. Uh, Everybody can hear you. This is the book of Daniel. Speak a little louder, brother. This is the book of Daniel, chapter 2, verse 31. Verse 31. Thou, O king, sawest, and behold, a great image, this great image, whose brightness was excellent, stood before thee, and the form thereof was terrible. This is Daniel talking uh, to King Nebuchadnezzar about the dream that he had. Uh, verse 32. The image head was of fine gold. God, the image head, head was of fine gold. was talking about the Babylonian Empire, of which was ruling at that time. Nebuchadnezzar. Of which was Assyrians under the Babylonian Empire. Okay. His breast and his arms of silver, that's the breast and his arm of silver represents the Middle Persian Empire. Okay. The mm -hmm. uh, second kingdom that was going to take down the Babylonian kingdom. Yeah. His yeah. belly and his thighs of brass, that represents the Greeks under Alexander the Great, who was going to take down the uh, Middle Persian. Right. His legs of iron. His legs of iron represents the Roman Empire, which came after the Greeks. His feet of iron and part clay represents uh, NATO and the EU, which is the uh, reincarnation of uh, the Roman Empire, mm. of which, one, which is what we have today. The, the beast. Uh, verse 34. The oh, you said the beast, right? Having what? Seven heads and ten horns? What are the seven heads? Seven. Seven heads are the Greeks, the Romans, the Spanish, the French, the British, West Germany, East Germany. That's it. You got it. I had to come with the spirit of Raha. What do you think it means? What do you think? That's it. Now, I see now, I I done the big tall brother. He broke it down, and I did a video on it. I kind of praised him, but I said you went off on the, on the part with Russia. Because that's what they used to teach at One West. That Russia was one of them head, seven heads. Russia was not was one of them seven heads. When you get an ancient map of the Roman Empire, Russia's not even in there, man. You know? So that's going back to that stuff that they learned from the seven. Given, given props to the seven, they didn't know, but they didn't know 100% truth. The high priest Ariya, as a video, high priest Ariya did not have 100% truth. We at GMS do. Yeah, they be talking so much shit about us. Hell but anyway, yeah. go ahead, you got it. God, book of Daniel, chapter 2, verse 34. Thou sawest till that the stone was cut out without hands. That's represented the Hamashai. Which more the image upon his feet. Now why did it say if it's supposed to the image on the feet? That's the feet, it's the iron of the clay, which is the beast system. Which is in power, which is going to be in power when Yahweh shall return. Which is the last king. The last king. Well, it's the end. It's the end of the king. Right. The end of the king. And the, the feet represent the end. Mm -hmm. Feet that were uh, iron and clay and break them to pieces. Then was the iron, the clay, the brass, the silver, and the gold broken to pieces together, and became like sharp. Of the, sum, of the summer threshing floors, and the wind carried them away. That no place. You know what shaft for the summer thr threshing floor is? It's like dust. You take a, a, a run, sweep it out. No power. To, there's no. There's no hope of them ever coming back in power. You know. Now what does that? Read that part again that you just read. Verse 35. Then was the iron, the clay, the brass, the silver, and the gold 
broke it to pieces, broke it to pieces together, and became like sharp, like the sharp of the summer to trash in the world. Now what scriptures are coming immediately come to mind? That's a good that's that's a good one. That's a good one. Psalms do we take away the wicked like Jack? That's a good one. I don't I'm not thinking about that, but that's another good one. Nope, that's another good one. That's a good, that's Job 20, that's a good one, that's not the one I'm thinking about. Uh, second Lazarus, how do we feed the model? Second Lazarus, that's another good one, I'm not thinking about that one. Malachi. What is the one? That's another good one. He just, he just said that. Somebody just said that, but that's a good one too, that's not, it's, I'll, I'll give you a hint, it's also in the book of Daniel. No, 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 it's, in, it's another point, another chapter in the book of Daniel. 4 and 17. Oh, um, 4 and 17. Say again? 4 and 17. Of what? Um, Daniel. 4 and 17, what does that say? That's uh, the outside rulers of the kingdom. Oh, yeah, well, that's Ooh. another good one. That's another good one. I think it's in Daniel 7 where it says, um, it says, um, they had it, they was taken out of the That's it, read it. That's what I was thinking of. But yeah, all, all of y'all were right. Because read what you just read out in Daniel 2 and then go right to Daniel 7 and 9. This is the book of Daniel, chapter 2, verse 35. Then was the iron, the clay, the brass, the silver, and the gold broke into pieces together and became like. Stop right there. The iron is what the Romans, right? The current Romans, or the beast, the ancient Romans, the pagan Romans, 2,000 years ago. The, uh, the the Greeks, all right, the Medo Persians, and the head of gold is uh, Babylon, uh, the ancient Babylon, right? So what does that mean? That they're still here, they're still in power. Mm -hmm. Okay. So go ahead, go go to where you can say seven and nine. Yeah, yeah. Day seven and nine. I beheld to the thrones were cast down, and the ancient of days did sit, whose garment was white as snow, and the hair of his head. Like the pure wool. That represents the most. Huh? Go ahead. His throne was like the, his throne was like the fiery flame, and his robes as burning fire. Ten, a fiery stream issued and came forth from before him. Thousand thousands ministered unto him, and ten thousand times ten thousand stood before him. The judgment was set, and the books were open. I beheld them because of the voice of the great word the horn spake. I beheld even to the beast was slain and his body destroyed and given to the burning flame. Boom. That's the nuclear missile destroying America. As concerning the rest of the beast, they had the meat taken away and allowed to prolong for a season of time. Why are they going to be prolonged for a season of time? Because they can go into slavery. You know? So Esau knows all this, man. You know? I saw in the night visions, and behold, one like the Son of Man came with the clouds of heaven and came to the Ancient of Days, and they brought him near before him. And there was given him dominion and glory in the kingdom, and all people, nations, and languages should serve him. His dominion is an everlasting dominion, which shall not pass away, and his kingdom that which shall not be destroyed. That's the kingdom. Esau knows this, man. Esau knows that he's going into slavery. Esau knows who those other, uh, the, the other parts of the kingdom the, the, before that, the Greeks, you know, the, 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 the medial Persians and so forth and so on, man. And they're still here. The medial Persians are still here. What are the Persians being called today? The people of Iran, yep. Um, today, I was, um, I got a video from Lisa Haven. I watch it from time to time. She's like, she put up news. No, I see that, I see that, yeah. And, uh, she said 16 nations formed themselves, formed an alliance together. Started with Russia, China, North Korea, uh, um, Iran and um, they went to the um they went to the um United Nations complaining about the sanctions that that United States is putting on them and they say either they're gonna either they either they're gonna do something about it or, or they're gonna do something about it. And the first one that came to my mind was um Jeremiah 50 and 9, when um the most I gonna allow when they see the great nation come up against Babylon and destroy her utterly. So I was like, wow. So um I'm gonna do a video on that tonight, Lord Will. And this thing and, and these prophecies in a whole keep your face face up but the prophecies really keep your face up the right. guys that get weak 
they're not reading them prophecy texts. They don't see it. You see someone in news, okay, oh, you kept saying this earlier about, about May 1st and, um, oh, yeah. and uh, Biden. What did Biden say recently in that speech that he made? Right, so what came to your mind? May Day. May Day. Now the average person out there, like a like Johanna, General Johanna, that's going right over his head. You know? Yep. And we were getting on Johanna, boy, that's it. Oh, that yo, them guys got to be fucking retards, man. Them guys are retards, man. If any of uh, well, y'all, hey, you, you and uh, you and the brother, Yahweh, you and the brother, you and um, Shaman ran into one of them guys, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we um, did a, um, that was years ago. But that was years ago. He was coming from the gym and, um, and um, the dude was talking about, the first thing he came up with was rape. And then we had this lady, she was like, I, well, I, I, you know, I would like to get raped. <laughs> remember, you remember that back then? We was bugging, like, yo, that shit was crazy. She was like, I like a man to take it. You know? That's the number one. Yeah. Most, most women like men to come a certain way, man. So, it's, you know? it's, it's the number one play, fantasy. Hey, this, women play, play hard to get until you, until you, you know, yeah. get aggressive. You know? <laughs> They like that aggression. And there's certain guys, I can't get it. I said, yeah, you can't get it because you're not taking it, man. <laughs> they, want it, they want her to be taken. She wants herself to be taken, man. Yeah, yeah. That's what they love. They fantasize about that. <laughs> you know? The daughters of Shiloh's. How they got, um, they, uh, Benjamin lied and wait for them. And um, we put the scriptures out. He was like, oh, the first thing he did was bring up the rape doctrine. Like, as we, we, and we cut him with that. Because first of all, that's in the scriptures. Man. We brought the daughters of Shiloh and Shiloh, you know, you know um, how they was dancing, you know. Which but that was too, that was to no avail because you're dealing with retards, man. Yeah. Anybody that's a part of the, uh, uh, the ISUBK are retards. You know? I'm dead serious. Tell me they tell me they ain't retarded. You know? Now 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 Tazari out here ain't retarded and Cat Captain Katazar, well, why are they there? Because I believe they're insiders, man. You know? Go ahead. Read on Dane 714 says the languages and nation of India, how shall this is um uh first Corinthians 15 27. It says, For he have put all things under his feet, most have put all things under Yahweh Shah. But when he says all things are put under him, it is manifest that he is accepted, except the most high, most of the under which did put all things under him. And when all things shall be subdued unto him, Yahweh Shah, then shall the Son also be subject unto him that put all things under him. So when all things put under Yahweh Shah. And how much is under the Most High, that the Most High may be all in all. So everything is under the Most High. Where are you reading from? Oh, uh, First Corinthians 15. So everything. That was read earlier yeah, today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. So all things under Yahweh Shah, and Yahweh Shah and the Most High, everything is under the Heavenly Father. So all of the men under the Most High. That's it. That's it. We're in that Beautiful. lineup, man. Yep. Beautiful. Yahweh, Yahweh Shah, then Yahweh Shah, then the Lecter Israel. Then the Russell Israel. You know? Yeah. Yahweh Shah, and then so is that it? Did he? Um, he got a little bit more left for that. This is the book of Daniel, chapter 2, verse 35. Then was the iron, the clay, the, the, the brass, the silver, and the gold broken to pieces together and became like the shaft of the summer threshing floors. And the wind carried them away. That when it's talking about the nuclear destruction. That's it, that's it. That no place was found for them because this, this land of America is not going to be inhabited no more by, uh, by humans. And the place was, and, and that, that no place was found for them, and that and the stone that smote the image became a great mountain and filled the whole earth. Kind of, that's talking about uh, the house of Shai and the elect of Israel, and a great mountain is talking about the kingdom of Israel, of which is a government that's going to rule the entire earth. Yeah. Verse 36 This is a dream. And we will tell the interpretation thereof before the king. Right. Now, when it says that the kingdom, the clay was partly strong and partly weak, what does that mean? Uh, that's going into uh, how the, the NATO system, some of the countries are uh, doing better, like Germany, France, uh, are like the top economic countries. Britain, Britain, Great Britain just Britain. left them. Right. Officially, just the beginning of last year. Brexit, right? Brexit, Brexit, Brexit man. Brexit. That's that breaking down, man. Yeah. You know? That's it. And we're we're at that that time right now. That's all that is being fulfilled as we speak right now. You know, so that's just letting you know that the prophecies are coming to pass. They're coming true. You know. That's pretty much it. Yeah, and this thing, you know, it'll be beautiful if we can get out of here 
in this year. Yes. Or maybe we might get out of here in 2022. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But we know we ain't going no 2045. There's too, no. there's too, too much tension in the air, man. Too many things are going on too fast. You know? That was it? That's it? That was it, yep. Alright, so we're going to loop this. We're going to loop this down.